Greetings, fellow portal masters. To all puzzle masses, I'm Crash Rousels. Once again, time to crash scans with another lock here on the channel. Welcome to the Skylar's Imaginator's worst lock. Now, ladies and gentlemen, before we get into this, of course, I'm going to discuss everything about this lock, why it's called the worst lock, even though it technically isn't the worst, and of course, the rules and everything involved. As you can see right away, though, this is a full video again. This is going to be another lock where the entire lock is uploaded. I will be honest, you guys were kind of split in the comments where you rather do an episode a week versus the full lock uploaded. I decided to give it another try of a full lock and see how this one goes. So let me know in the comments if you prefer this one or the other way. Um, I prefer if you don't skip to the end though. Like the video uploads, go to the end and see if I beat it. No, no, no. Watch it. Watch it through. Make yourself, encourage yourself to watch each episode and then just step skipping to the end. Of course, a few are going to do it anyways. So, well, hopefully by the end of it, I win this. But we'll go into the details now in a little bit. But thank you for watching another one of these locks. The first one did go over pretty well, where I uploaded the whole thing in one sitting, where I did the Trap Team Core Lock V2, uh, yeah, which went over pretty well. But this is going to be the first unique new lock, and we're going into Imaginators, where as of right now, I'm one for one. I've done two locks in Imaginators. The first one was the Imagine Lock, where I won. The second one was the Villain Lock, excuse me, where I lost. So... We're going to get back right into this one today. Ladies and gentlemen, let's describe the rules of the worst lock. But before we do that, let's explain what I mean by worst. So as you can see, the Skylanders on the side there, those are the Skylanders that I consider my least favorite out of every Skylander in Imaginators. So of course, I had to do one of every element. I'm playing as Grave Club right now. And you guys are like, Crash, you love Grave Club. He was a perfect five in RCF Hour. Why'd you choose him? Well, out of him, Tidepool, and Kingpin... Grave Clobber is probably the lowest because I adore Tidepool. Tidepool is one of my favorites. And then Kingpin is up there as kind of meh, while Grave Clobber is kind of with them too. So it took me a little while to figure out that. Certain ones is very easy. Like, I can't stand Bad Juju. Everyone knows that. I'm also not the biggest fan of Hoodsickle. As I just realized, my headphones are very much tangled up in the Imaginators right now. Let me just... And you know I don't like Robo at all. So some of them are very easy, but however, my fire ones, I think all three fire scholars are fantastic, but everyone knows how much I love Flare Wolf and Taekwon Crow more than I love Ember. So when it comes to the worst lock, this is more of the least favorites lock, but to make it a better title, so you guys can click on it, <laughs> it's the worst lock. So hope you guys understand that, but we will be playing as all the scanners you see on the side there, and let's get into the rules. Ladies and gentlemen, the rules are as followed. I'm only allowed to play as the 10 Skylanders that I find the worst <laughs> in Imaginators. I'm only allowed to switch to those Skylanders when an element of that area becomes stronger in that zone. So, as right now I'm playing as Grave Clobber, if it switches to the Magic Element, I then switch to Buckshot, and I have to play with him until either it switches to a new element, or the Skylar is defeated in battle. Because the biggest thing is if a Skylar is defeated in battle, they are considered dead. And I cannot use them again for the rest of the lock. And to show you guys the truth here, I am going to be playing on expert mode. Yep, I switched to expert mode and I did it on camera to show you guys that I am switching to it. I'm semi-confident with this one. Oh, right. And the lock ends with either me losing all 10 of my Skylars or defeating Chaos. I gotta say, I am... Always nervous, excited, playing Imaginators, especially in a lock. I feel like the characters I have this time around, I'm a little more confident with. I'm like, I know I'm great with Ember and Buckshot and Golden Queen and Aurora, but other ones I'm not too sure. So we'll see how this goes. Um, I'll say I'm 50-50 confident, but I would like to go into the next lock with a 2-1 record at Imaginators, so... Ladies and gentlemen, let's get this started. Episode 1, of course, how it's going to go is going to be the episode at the end. I'm going to, like, cut it off with a little black screen then go to the next episode so you can follow along that way. But let's get it started with Episode 1. That's right. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Mm -mm -mm. Got some Burger King today. I tried their new Garlic Whopper. It's not great. I'll let you guys know. And, of course, we are skipping all the cutscenes. We don't need to watch any of the cutscenes. Thank you. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I am excited for this. Another lock here on the channel. Now, there's only going to be 10 episodes of this because there's only 10 actual levels. Because we're not doing any of the DLCs. That's right, Justin Long. This isn't actually Justin Long. It's just that's your voice in the Skyrim Academy. Now, where is this so-called imaginator I'm supposed to meet? 
It's Grave Clobber. I'm already here. Welcome, Skylander. Thanks for coming out to help. I'm Grave Clobber. Anyways, um, Justin Long, by the way, since a new thing has happened since uh, before that, Justin Long is in the new Goosebumps series on Disney Plus. Oh man, fantastic show! Probably one of the best like new shows that came out. I was not expecting Goosebumps to be as good as it was. So like, yeah, if you guys want something to watch. Goosebumps on Disney Plus is a fantastic choice. Justin Long's in it. He's the Scream Queen we all know and love. So, like, yeah, big fan of Justin Long in that. Bam! Kablam! Kablam! <laughs> so, yeah, the big rule, of course, is I'm just going to tear through every level as fast as I can because, you know, I don't want to dilly-dally around and lose and die. Let's go, baby. Oh, I almost missed the lariat then. Yeah, there we go. I gotta remember his lariat move. That's definitely the biggest one. So gotta remember that lariat move because that's good for hitting Skylanders from far away. Um, cool thing too. Yeah, I get it, Spyro. You, we've heard this a billion times. So I actually don't have every item unlocked in Imaginates for PS4. So we're gonna be getting some new items, as I say, a duplicate bazooka right out of the game. Right, thank you. Thanks, buddy. All right, here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, let's continue this on here. Gonna be honest, have not played Imagineers in a very long time. The last time I played Imagineers was to film clips for my top 167, which is probably coming out soon by the time I have this up ready. I think my plan is to have this out before that, of course. I really hope I have <laughs> by then. <laughs> I'll be honest with ya. Water Skylander! Water Skylander! Well, I forgot it does start with Kingpin. So Grave Clobber is our entry number one. <laughs> Accidentally starting with Grave Clobber here. Nice, look at that. We can layer through the Sensei Shrine. No special feat for this one. I know when it came to, um, what's it called? The Villain Lock Chaos was an option, like Chaos Mode and all that. But this time around, no special thing with this one. It's just going to be a basic lock with your boy, Awesome Possum himself, me, Oh, the Chompy. We got our first hit already, folks. A Chompy already smacking into Grave Clabert. Good good idea for a, um, a challenge on the channel. No hit challenge. I am feeling this. Woo! Woo! Oh, 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 oh. Any sentry now. All right. Of course, the only real fights to me that are probably going to be challenging are the Doomlander fights. Anytime I play this game, I always know the Doom Raider or Doom Lander fights are always going to be semi-tough. Who built a big maze right in the middle of their fortress? Oh yeah, I guess the ancients. They do, yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Is a way to confuse solicitors or something? Skylander, Skylander, you are amazing. I've heard this a couple times. Um, the only reason I know this fully is because way back in the day, my every Sky Chi ranked video. Does this look familiar to you? Since trying to so we're no switch at all. Oh, I could have made the rule where I could switch anyone I want. But yeah, so there's the battle gong. Obviously, we're not doing the battle gong. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But anyways, um, this is where I recorded all the characters. So I literally did this level over and over again for all of the 30... Imaginator, I think what it was. Was it 30 at the time? Is it 30? Because I didn't count chaos. Ooh. Literally have already done that uh, spiral there, buddy. Come on, Justin Long. Look at that. We got a holiday hat. Oh, and it's probably December when I upload this. Perfect timing. We got ourselves a holiday hat. Guys, we can make Christmas crash the Skylands here. Oh, I tried to walk along the edge. That's that's my running thing. Is that I always try to just walk along the edge because there's no point to actually, like, do the normal thing. I'm an idiot. <laughs> This one, you actually need to do the, you know, normal thing, as I just said. <laughs> but that little area there, you have to actually walk across. Random little, like, adventure here. Oh, we got a duplicate. That's fine. Boost the stats, though. Easy peasy. Tearing through this. Of course, as I said, the only one I'm actually semi-worried about is the Doom Lander fight itself. What the? Where'd you, you get on there? You're not allowed on there. Rochacho. Boingus. 
Nope, we wait. I'm not going down there. Bamba. 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 Bonga. Boingus. So yeah, all the Skylars are fully level up too. They're all at level 20 with all of their abilities. So, gonna be no level ups, no things to come up with. You're not gonna see more increase and stuff like that, but yes. Shoinkus. Imaginators are stronger here. Too bad. I do we do don't have those. Woo! What the okay. My Lariat went the exact wrong way I wanted it to. We plan on expert! But I also remember Glade Grave Clobber is literally the heaviest hitter in the entire franchise. I don't know if you guys knew that. As far as I know, he I think he has the biggest base attack stat you can get, so. A lot of people will be like, oh, that's why you chose him, Crash. You actually don't like, uh, you actually don't like Tide Pool the most. No. Watch my Honesty Half Hour. I rip into you viewers about hating Tide Pool. Because Tide Pool is absolutely fantastic. Whenever I work on the, um, Second Chance video, there's a video I'm working, I'm going to be working on in the future. It's like a Skylar's used to give a second chance to. Tide Pool will be on that list. Because I adore Tide Pool and I think everyone else should too. I'm also going to be doing these snail challenges because they will give me the Imaginate Chests. I will be collecting all the Imaginate Chests. I'm only at like 94%, if I'm not mistaken, of this game's actual completion. Do a live stream one day where I sit there and actually collect everything. Got a brain hat, though. Got a brain hat. Here we go. We are heading to the battle with the Doomlander here now. This should be very interesting. I'm excited. For our first big battle... We'll see how this goes, I'll be honest, so. Of course, very nervous. Agree, ha 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 ha, indeed. Doesn't matter, I'm laying India anyway, so who cares? Yump! You say he's hit he hits me pretty hard there with his regular move, but oh we got one down already, baby. Wumpus! <laughs> Yeah, I bet you can use my magic. Come on over. Ah, 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 ah. You hit your little move. You paint your pretty little pictures. There you go. Boinkus! Yoink! Ah, we're, we're doing something here, folks. Oh, made a mistake. Yeah, I made a mistake that time. Oh, we got some. We got some bananas, though. Wow. Womp. <laughs> I always tried to do the womp at the end there. Lots of purple on the screen. You notice that? Come here, bro chacho. Oh, come here, bro chacho. Don't you dare. Boing! Oh, that would have been an excellent boing. You ready? Hop ya! Come on, you. Easy, easy. Oh, man. Am I supposed to be worried about you, Rasan? Am I supposed to be worried about you? Oh, man, I wasn't worried at all. Grave Clobber, the heavy hitter he is. Oh, that orb's still chasing me down, though. Didn't appreciate that one. Oh, 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 don't know why I'm doing that. <laughs> Don't know why I was randomly pressing triangle the whole time there. New hat that we didn't have. New hat we didn't have. And a new hat we didn't have! Woo First level done, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah! We're off to a start. And I beat it within the time frame, too. All right, level one done, ladies and gentlemen. We are heading to the Mushroom River next. Which is be exciting, because Mushroom River is actually my favorite level in this game. Eventually. Yeah, here we go. It's going to load back to screen every time. All right, let's cut the video now. Cut to Mushroom River, which is the next level. Ladies and gentlemen, let's get this started. See you in a couple seconds. All right, here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Episode two of the Worst Lock here. You know what I remembered? And I just remember this in between saving the last video footage and saving this one. We're not going to be doing the stupid cake missions. We're not going to be fighting the guacamole monster in this one. So I think this might be the best lock of all time. 
yeah, literally. For Imagineers, this is going to be the best playthrough of this entire series of my life. Because I don't have to do the stupid cake missions that are a waste of time. And I don't need to do the guacamole monster, which is literally a waste of time. Speaking of wasting your time, welcome to the next episode of The Lock. I hope you guys are enjoying this series as much as I am. Let's get right into it. Second episode. Oh, excuse me. So I mentioned earlier, obviously I'm recording all of this basically in one sitting. Um, but yeah, I am... Uh, I had Burger King garlic, roasted garlic burger, and all I taste is garlic. So luckily, smell o vision is not a thing, or you would not enjoy this microphone right now. Yeah, 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 sure is, buddy. Let's go to the fight. Air Skylanders are in action. Ladies and gentlemen, that means it is a debut, hilariously, of my actual least favorite Imaginator. Imaginator character, Bad Juju. Now, do not get me wrong. I don't like Bad Juju. It does not mean she is horrible. I just personally don't like her literally at all. But I do like this move. Just gonna be honest with you guys, you're gonna be seeing a lot of that this playthrough whenever I play as bad Juju. Because I don't like using Juju Jr. and I don't understand her other move. Like there's just this lightning where you hit bad Juju or Juju Jr. And then you go whoop! Stay there! Stay there! Stay there! Yunk! 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 <laughs> Come here you! Oh let's see, can I kill both of them with just yet bad Juju? Juju Jr. All right. Am I winning? Did I do it? So was that good? Was that cool? Like, did I do that properly? <laughs> as, hor as horrible as that is to say, did I just play as bad Juju properly? <laughs> Never once. Oh, wait, Water Skylander. Wait, when the heck did it change? Am I stupid? It is stupid. I bet it, I bet it was back when I went up to that top area. I'm, I'm Guys, it, I'm, I've never once said I was good at this. So... You know. Oh my, that was a weird, very long load time for some reason there. Let's get him, let's get him, let's get him, let's get him. Yonkus. I really gotta pay attention to the actual, I don't know, game? Instead of me just... Just like that, we have ourselves another debut. I forgot to show the camera, but there's really no room for me to move things around here, so... Chop to you drop. Chop Scotch is here. Now, of course, y'all know how much I love Pit Boss. And probably some of you are being like, Crash, you never picked Wolfgang. Very interesting. That honestly have our episode, folks. Remember, I talk about it all the time. That episode with Wolfgang was one of my favorite ones to record. Because that's when I realized that giving Skylanders an actual second chance where I give them a full playthrough of just focusing on them and their moves is going to be something that's going to make me enjoy them even more. And that's how it happened. So unfortunately, Chopscotch, even though I love playing as her, and I absolutely love, oh, I was going to say the, the head throw move. I do enjoy playing as your boy Wolfgang a little bit more. So we got new shoulder guard, Stormy Shoulders. Let me just, I'm very curious now. It is expert, okay. I guess they're just really strong, because you know the Imaginators are... Another debut, ladies and gentlemen, taking no time with the debuts here, with Aurora from the Light Skylanders. Light Skylanders, I tell you. Oh, I'm not going to even get that. All right, I guess we got to wait. How's your day going? Okay. <laughs> Thank you guys so much, actually, for tuning in for this. I know I've been doing videos now coming on to my ninth year with Crash the Skylands, which is wild to think about. 2024, literally right around the corner, and I'm coming on to my ninth year of Crash the Skylands. So, I mean, I appreciate every single one of you coming back and watching this. Still actually being legit fans of the channel after all these years, coming and going. I know a lot of people are like, oh, I don't watch your videos as much anymore. And the fact that you even watched them to begin with is probably my favorite thing. Here we go. We're going to leave that there for the next guy. Oh, yeah. I love the fact that there is a trophy you can get for leaving Eruptor on that thing. Look how fast Aurora is, man. Like, it's kind of disgusting with how fast she is. Look at that. Look at all. Oh, I'm tearing through it here. Absolutely tearing through these Skylanders. Or enemies. These enemy Skylanders. 
Sensei's retire here means no change. We are sticking with your girl, Aurora. Oh, you know what I could have done? Since I'm doing two, since I do have villains and, um, does do have villains and senseis? When it says sensei is strong, I can switch to any sensei I want. When it says imaginaries, I can switch to any villain I want. And yes, I know the villains are considered senseis. I'm not stupid. I mean, I am, but not in this aspect, you know? Tearing through these guys. Look at this, though. Aurora is so fast. It's disgusting how fast she is. Woohoo! But yeah, that could that could have been a good at rule is when it's a sensei, I can switch to any of the I got a mohawk then. Any of the actual senseis. Or when it switched to magic, I can switch to any of the villains, so. That would have been a good thing to have. I would see, I would implement that now, of course. I would be like, oh, let's just do that now, but that would ruin the fun because I would have been able to switch twice in the opening part. I don't know, when I do my favorite slot, which is coming up. At some point, not anytime soon, obviously, because I'm literally, you're literally watching the worst lock right now, and I have my next lock plan right after, too. Aurora is very low health, I just realized. I should be very more careful here. She's very fast, but, like, yeah, I forgot her health is not really great. Yoinkus? Yeah, I gotta remember, her health is not very good, so... I got the big boy. Come on, you. Yes, got you. There we go. We got him. I gotta be careful with that. I just I forgot Aurora's health is not really great. We, we, we sure did, Aurora. Life Skylander, another debut of the Choppy Mage. And you're not a Choppy, so I don't like you. Choppy power! Choppy power! Now, obviously, I'm playing as the Jingle Bell Choppy Mage because you might not know this, but I don't have a thousand dollars laying around to just go buy the new, the regular one. Surprise, surprise! Am I right, fellas? Don't worry. One, one time in when I'm like in my mid fifties and I'm retired and I can save all my money for you know retirement, and I don't need to buy anything else besides for like a bit of food every now and then. Anyways, come on, we're t you're done talking. I could buy regular Chompy Mage. Can you? Those ch the Chompies just got mo. Yeah, destroy all the blocks, please, so I can push these balls properly into here. This is gonna be a decent uh, place to fight, by the way, because he's the Brawler Skylander, and if I don't change, I'm gonna be using Chompy Mage, which he does have a interesting variety of moves, especially that one where he can you know, I can throw acorns. It's you like, it's you like. Of course, there's Choppy Ball. I gotta remember that, too. Ooh. I forgot about this move. Where I can shoot staffs at him. I can shoot staffs at anybody. That's a move. Woohoo! Alright, here we go. <laughs> he has a point. It is going pretty fast. <laughs> Yep. You did it. You didn't fall off the raft. See, and then I could switch to any villain I want. So I could stay as Chompy Mage, or I could switch to, like, Grave Clobber, or Bad Juju, or Robo. I could say Robo villain. <laughs> Guys, I don't like Robo. I don't care what any of you say. He is the most overhyped Skylander that did not deserve the hype at all. So, Boingus, Boingus. All right, it looks like we are going to take on the Brawler Doomlander as the Jumpy Mage. Here we go. Hello again. Yeah, it was going to Chompy Mage. Luckily, my Chompies do a lot more damage. Don't tell me what to do, first of all. You're not doing what I want you to do, Chompy Mage. I'm, like, doing moves here. Jeez, he's not doing, like, any damage. Like, I thought he'd be doing a lot more damage right now, but he's not doing, like, anything. Jeez. Am I doing something wrong here? Oh, the ball does some decent damage, though. Okay. Okay. 
Oh yeah, this is where he has his little, his range. And, I think the Chompy, they hit. The Chompies can take the hit! All right, baby boy, I will take that all day of the week. The Chompies will take the hit if they're in the way. So, like, I will gladly use the Chompies to my advantage in that aspect. Oh, good. I did not know the Chompies take that hit. Ah. The Chompies still giving it to him there. Like, look at him. Whoop! Oh, they didn't block me that time. They didn't block him that time. Yeah, get them, Chompies. Get them, Chomp Chomps. Oh, I walked into that one. Not my smartest move. Eh? NGL, NGL. That stands for not going to lie, folks. I'm learning a lot of things, you know. I'm the I'm the cool, hip Skytuber, you know? Like, the one everybody loves. Everyone's favorite cool, hip Skytuber. He's like, oh, he's totally not in his 30s. Am I right, fellas? Oh, gosh! Oh, I got stuck on a tree house. A bee house, actually. It's a bee house, not a tree house. Oh! Come on, get them, chompy babies. Get them, my chompy babies. Get them, my chompy babies. You can take him out, don't worry. I'm the chompy mage, and I am your father, and I love you. <laughs> Yo, that was a lot more fun than I thought it was going to be. And I am, I'm really annoying. Yes. I'm assuming you, man, they put a lot of ice in this. I never put ice in my drinks. Oh, already got that one. Already got that one. Don't have the all-seeing hat, though. And that's another level done, ladies and gentlemen, as Eruptor Lava Barfs. Don't you throw up on Ashley Tisdale like that. <laughs> that's right, I know all of the voice actors. Jonathan Banks does Eruptor. And um, Dino... Pop Lopovich, or whatever his name is, Pop Pop Fizz. He actually takes his name. Same with Jetpack. He's the actual characters. Let's skip this. I don't need to see this. No one needs to see this. The story doesn't matter in Imagineers. It's not that great anyways. But yes, ladies and gentlemen, we are heading on to Scholarville next. So we will be seeing you very soon in literally a couple seconds. We'll see you in a minute. A couple seconds. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, it's episode 3 here on the Worst Lock here on the channel. Last episode was very fun, uh, finding out that Chompy Mage can use his Chompies to take hits for him. Is Shadowish a good thing? Speaking of, it's a pretty good level. So let's get right into it, wasting no more time here. Ba -ba -ba -da. We're getting right into it. Of course, we are skipping all the cutscenes and stuff. Hope you guys are enjoying this playthrough. I know Imaginators is like a shorter one when it comes to lock format. I also know characters as fast as I can. But this one's pretty wild when it comes to lock format, if we come to think of it. Air Skylanders. Bad Juju coming out. We have one, two, three, five left to debut. So we're only two episodes in. We already have five debuted, which is good. Um, of course, Chompy, or, um, what's his name? Grave Clobber would have uh, had his debut already if it wasn't for me just choosing him right away. So he still would have got his debut. Look at this. Easy, 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 easy. Oh, God. Oh, no. On top of me? There's no keeping out the bad juju. Everybody, just thought you ought to know. There we go. There we go. Whoop, whoop, whoop. There we go. Here we go. And the poor tree gets shot in the chest. Yep. Let's go. Blam, 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 blam. Oh god, I trapped myself. I trapped myself! Oh! That's the real trap team right there. I legitimately just trapped myself then. It was kind of fun. We got a debut, ladies and gentlemen. Ember making her debut in the worst lock here. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. La 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 la. Uh oh. Yeah, get him, get him, get him. Oh, yeah. I also got to remember one of my favorite moves. The womp, the womp, the womp, the womp. <laughs> yep, and we go. Let's grab ourselves some health just to be safe. Since I, oh, I can switch anyone I want. Would have been a great idea, come to think of it, man. Like.
Like, look at this move. Look at this move, man. The damage it does, especially since I'm a sensei too, so. Like, th this move does more damage than my regular attack. <laughs> that's kind of that's kind of sad, man. Right, I can do that too, bruh. That might have been really loud in the microphone. I apologize. I don't apologize. I'm sorry, but I'm not apologizing. I just want to kill him with my my sentinel just for the fun of it. Boink kiss. Yay! I was gonna say I thought I got a uh, a chest out of that one. A tailed cape. Nice. Tail cape is, I think, the one that. Oh, it's not this way. I, I've never done that before, where I went the wrong way in this level. This is the right way because this boosts you back up. We got ourselves a debut. Robo making his debut, and I have the actual figure. For the four people out there who are like, oh, Crash has Robo? He's using an NFC card? No, I actually own Robo. Here you go. I'm holding him up to the camera so you can see. This is the Robo figure. He's real. I bought him new. He was only 20 bucks or 25 something like that at Toys R Us. I got him new. If I knew he was going to be the rarest figure basically of all time, I would have kept him in the box. Because actually, if you guys know, I played with him on, on the channel. I did the last Imaginite Mines, the full level on the channel. And I was one of the first ones to upload it. Woohoo! Get that load. Had to reply to that text real quick. I know. He's back at it again. <laughs> nice. We already had that done, though. Why did I get that twice? I love rapidly pressing R1. Come here, nerds. Ha 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 ha. That's me rapidly pressing R1, by the way. I don't know if you can actually hear me pressing the R1 button. Probably does. I do click the controller really hard, as I found out. So I'm really rough. I'm really rough on my controllers, but funnily enough, I, uh, I haven't broken a controller ever in my entire life. Just so do the anger or something like that too. I would never, like, I always, I do treat my controllers rough, but I would never ever um, break a controller. We're just gonna stand back. We're just gonna stand back, bro. Oh, there was an arrow somehow. It just hit me there. This is the Doomlander battle come up here now, isn't it? Guys, am I playing on expert? Like for real? Am I playing on expert? Oh, I didn't realize that was a bomb on me. I thought it already hit me. I would have moved in if I knew that. Bump. <laughs> oh, there he is. Yunk. Oh, no. What was that? Did, did I just do a combo? Oh, uh, he does do combos. I didn't know that. <laughs> oh, God. Robo's health is very low right now. And I got a Doom Lander fight coming up, like, now, basically. Health around here? There is not. I love that for me. I have a Doom Lander fight coming up, like, literally right now. Come on, come on, come on, you. Don't you pounce on me. Can you stop barking at me? Bow, 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 bow. So annoying. Like, just die already, bro. Thank you. And here comes the Doomlander fight. Uh-oh. Robo's health is very low, folks. Robo's, Robo's health is very low, folks. Very, very low. Guys, oh, I jumped in the air and did... I'm doing moves in the air. I'm not doing what I want me to do. Yeah? Seems to be working, though. Can some one of you drop food, please? Why do... Oh, my God, one of them actually dropped food. There's a first for everything. Come here, you. 
Let's just shoot you from far away here. I don't like that my jump move is that. I don't care though. How much is the Oh stop! What's the what's this one? 180? Okay, this is actually like a better move actually. This is a stronger move than my actual arrows, and it looks like it does more damage. It's 180, and it still does the same range, so like okay. Okay. Now, I'm going to do what I always do when it comes to this one, and when we get to the actual, uh, what's it called? I get him to hit himself. Hit yourself, hit yourself, hit yourself. Oh, not yet. It's when the Wrecking Ball comes down. It's easy to kill these guys. Oh, no, it isn't. Never mind. Thought it was easy to kill these guys. I guess it's when I was a sensei. I mean, I still am a sensei. What am I talking about? I love shooting the lasers, though. The laser eye is pretty good. Not gonna lie. The fact that his laser eye is stronger than my regular arrow move. Hey, second one down, second one down. Get out of the way! Because <laughs> as far as I know, that can actually hurt me, so. Alright, so what I do now is I let the, the cannons shoot him. I try to, at least. I say the wrecking ball, but it's the cannons. The wrecking ball is later in another level. So, Bompus... Wampus Boo. Wampus Woo. You stay there and keep getting hit, bro. Stay there and keep getting hit. Like, look at that. What an idiot. He's just like, I'm just gonna get shot, you know? Like, he doesn't even move. Like, he's gonna die now, basically. Yeah. <laughs> My health is low. I gotta be careful, but these spinny dudes are in the way here. But he's gonna get hit again. This guy loves not get moving out of the way. <laughs> And we beat him! <laughs> I think his favorite thing is just getting hit. Getting hit with the, uh, the cannons. I mean, if I'm playing as Robo, they will be, but... Because the problem is, it's always Imaginators are stronger against them. Not Senseis, Imaginators. Meaning that... Oh, I gotta hold the hat again. Meaning that when I face them as, like, Robo and all that, I am not gonna do as great. Because, you know, I need to be an Imaginator. Undead Skylander. Alright, Robo, you take your well-deserved break there, bucko. Hey, I beat him with Robo. But as I said, what a disappointing thing. His main move... Did, like, multiple damage to the smaller ones. Cool. But then I'd go and do it with, uh... The laser eye. His laser shot move. And it's stronger. And does the exact same range. So, like, why would I not use his laser move instead? Whoop! <laughs> I'll just... Just grab that. Just for just for the fun of it. Just for the fun of it. Woohoo! Yoink! Here we go. So, like, you beat the Doom Lander, so it's like, by the way, we're not done yet. There's still another fight. <laughs> With the stupid tentacle sewer monster thing. Woohoo! There we go. I always don't realize when that laughing... Is that the snail? Is that the snail laughing? I wanted to try to hit that from over here. Oh, they did, he it did it anyways. Thanks, head. Very cool. It's funny. I don't usually get this far in the level anymore, like because I usually use it to record clips. Dark. We got our next debut. Only two left to debut later, and that is. Hood Sickle from the Dark Element as I knock over Grave Clobber. If you haven't noticed, Grave Clobber is a lot more top heavier than most of the other Skylanders. See if I can actually do this grind challenge, because God forbid the game lets me do it properly sometimes. Many of times I'll be doing the grind challenge, and the game's like, by the way, you didn't do the grind challenge. Boop, 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 boop. Because, like, I'll go to hop to the right, and it's just like, nah, you're hopping in the air now. 
You're hopping in the air. You're 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 up. Oh darn, you missed it. Sorry, bro, bro, chacho. This is the first grind challenge though in the entire game, if I'm not mistaken. And I nailed it. Give me my imaginary chest. Chest add to vault. Look at that. And look at that. I can use a Sentinel Skylander to go up to to get my move, my Sky Chi. I'm not doing that. Ugh. Bloom, 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 bloom. Oh gosh. But ah! There we go. I'm too fast for my own good. Too fast, too furious. Crack. Here we go. All right. Let's get this started. Let's gonna open this a little bit to let some more natural light in on my face here. I am still here, sadly. I was gonna say, I can shoot a, uh, what's it called, Adam? Get out of here. I'm not gonna hit you at all. Uh, there's no point. Some health over there, though. I can get some health there. Yoinkus! Ha ha ha! Ha ha ha! You can't yoinkus me. I yoinkus you! You have been yoinkused. Let's go. We're gonna leave that health there just in case. Look at that. I got the black hole set up. Oh, never mind. I was gonna say, no matter which which party comes up from. This is like one of the most mediocre battles in the entire game. And I have to take the health to attack him. That's a bummer. Oh my. Legit, this is probably one of the most mediocre battles in Skylanders. Yeah, here we go. Maybe, that, maybe that's a good list idea. Top five mediocre boss battles. And I'll do boss in quotation marks. Because, like, another one I can think of, because it is a joke, is, um, what's his name in Giants? The one before you... Wait, is it the Hermit? Is it the Hermit? No, that's Brock. The one in Giants where he's just, like, super duper strong. He, t t he thinks he's super duper tough. But he's actually uh, a little winkling. When you hit him once, he goes, ow, owie, you know? Leads up to like, this whole battle where you have to fight him, and then you hit him once, and he's like, no, I stop. You know the one I'm talking about. I don't remember his name. Leave me alone. Was he supposed to pop up there? Whoa! No, he hasn't. Surprise, surprise. There we go. Come up on the edges. Just just come up on the edges. Oh, okay. Never mind. Okay. Like, this is such a boring fight. Like, I... This is a boring fight. Like, this is boring. Like, there's nothing entertaining about this. You've got to memorize this pattern. He comes up because he's tired for some apparent reason. And then he climbs up on the shore because he's tired, which makes total sense. And then he comes up here where he can attack you from the edge. And you just lean on this side and he can't hit you and you can just hit him like crazy. And then he does this again. Like, boring fight. Man, it's clear, it's obvious that the boys at Toys for Bob phoned this one in when they made the game. When they made this one, man. They phoned in this whole game, come to think of it, guys. You come to think of it, they, they, this game is not their brightest of works. Crashing Rumble, fun as heck, though. Definitely picking up the full copy of that game in the future. I, I really enjoyed the beta when I played it. So, Plus, Spyro's getting added. So, By the time we watch this, Spyro probably is added. And Ripto's a permanent character, too. So, like, I, 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 I need those. I'm a Spyro boy. I always have been. Always will be. So you got nothing else to talk about during this boring fight, you know? Like, what, what am I supposed to talk about during this boring fight? Wow. What an actual waste. Like, this level is... Oh my god, it's almost been 20 minutes since I've been recording this episode. And I feel like I've done nothing. Like, literally nothing in this. 
Can you believe this is the same episode that I just fought the Doom Doomlander with Robo? And I was using the laser eye? You guys know that, right? This is the same level. There you go, idiot. Take the hit. Oh! Woo, look at that move. Time to get moved. Watch, I am moving. I'm moving my whole body. I'm moving my mouth. Oh, got stuck there. There's the Helm of Ultimate Wisdom. There it is. The Helm of Ultimate Wisdom. Oh, hurry up, please. <sighs> You're welcome. You're welcome, buddy. Look at this mark on my eye, guys. Like, what is that? You can see it plain as day, too. Okay. Oh. Uh, I agree. I, I agreed with you, Chaos. It's empty now. Just like my heart for this level. Yoink. 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 You can't even hit me, bro. Why are you so stupid? This level, man. <laughs> I still remember playing through this level the first, like if you, because I did my first ever Imagination playthrough is on the channel. I didn't, I didn't play it separately. So good news, guys, you can fall into the water. That's the first I think I've ever done in this. So I just made history. Oh, why was I playing as Crusher though? Yeah, I was gonna say I knew, I knew we came to one of the sides. I remember which one. Like, why is the sea monster fighting me anyways? Like, I you, I got no beef with you. I got no beef with you. You just, you're attacking me. You're attacking me. I had no clue you could fall into the water, so that just changed everything for me. <laughs> got a shoulder shell. Heroes in a shoulder shell. Turtle power. That's a Ninja Turtles reference. I love the Ninja Turtles. But you don't understand, I love the Ninja Turtles. And we still beat that under the time. This is it, Glumshanks. Oh. It's mine. Yep, cool. All right, we're heading to Shell Mod Shores next, which is going to be in literally a couple minutes. So yes, let's head there now, and I'll see you in literally a couple seconds. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here we go, episode four, or if you guys are watching this in one sitting, the next little piece. Anyways, we are going to Shellmont Shores now, wasting no more time, Shelmont Shores. and get right into it. Shellmont Shores, um, if I remember correctly, it's the swashbuckler at the end, which is kind of tough, so we'll see how that one goes. I do know that, of course, every level is going to get harder from here. I completely forgot about Sky Fortress, which is coming up later on. That's the fifth episode, so that's going to be a harder one. Um, I got a feeling there's going to be a Water Skylar Grave Clobber joining us right away here. But yeah, I got a feeling that certain levels are going to become a lot harder and more difficult in the later on. But we'll see how it goes for anything as I quickly rearrange my Skylanders layer. Womp! <laughs> Look at that guy. He just got womped. I love just womping things with Grave Clobber. Gra Grave Clobber is probably the best best Whomper in Skylanders. If you think about it, if you had to list the top 10 Whompin Skylanders, someone would be like, oh, what about Crash Bandicoot? It's Whompa. That's Whomp, not Whomp. Uh -oh, Yoink. <laughs> I drop kicked him. He even hit me too. He, I drop kicked him and he still hit me. That's unfair. I'm calling the police right, right now. Whomp. Oh, gee, okay, that wasn't what I wanted it to do, but that's okay. <gasps> oh, Lord. It blobbers. Hey, Skylander. It's me, blobbers. Yep. Am I supposed to be afraid of that? Now, that makes more sense. If you excuse me, just screams. <laughs> Yoink, here we go. Light Skylanders. All right, we are switching to Aurora. We gotta remember her health is not great. 
We so we gotta be safety safer with Aurora here. <laughs> Why do you guys watch my videos? <laughs> Give me back your fast love. There's your speed run hack for any of you speed runners out there watching. Yo, what a great idea. We should, though. What just happened? Not sure what just happened there. I guess it's the fact that I did the grind challenge while I was leaping forward, and the game is just like, I can't run two things at once, meh. Oh, I got that one, buddy. That's the one I usually screw up. Remember I said last episode where I was just like, I like to jump and it like, so I was like, nah, dude, you did not jump. That's what I mean. That's the one. That's the exact one I mean. What? Have you never played a Tony Hawk game, Jetpack? Guys, we need to put, we need to get Jetpack. Tony Hawk Pro Skater 1 and 2 HD Remaster. How fun was that game? That was really fun. I should get that for the Nintendo Switch. It's a bit of a fun game just to have, you know, a blast with. Let's go. Here we go. Oh, don't explode on me. Ladies and gentlemen, we... Well, that was garbage. What was that? Why didn't you let... What do you take about the portal? They're supposed to switch. So Aurora just took a needless hit just then. Golden Queen is here, though. She does reign supreme, and my watch is telling me to take a walk. Will you tell me to touch grass? No, I don't want to. Touching grass is stupid. Scarab! That's not what I wanted, actually. I wanted the scarab, but there we go. This also works. Look at that damage I'm doing, bro. Ooh, you moron. You absolute unit of an idiot. <laughs> Look at that. That gold thing working fan. Fantastic here. Oh, I golded all three of you. You've all been golded. There's five of you, though, but I golded two or three of you. Come on, you. Yeah. Gold medal winning performance, she was going to say, but you guys were wondering. Yep, there it is. You guys were wondering what she was going to say. For some reason, you didn't hear her say it. <laughs> I was like, sorry, I wasn't listening. Let me just uh, grab some bananas. Thank you. Here we go, baby. Woohoo. Is this the episode where the camera focused on Golden Queen's booty in my original Imaginaries playthrough? I think this was. Yeah, it is. It's up there. <laughs> the camera decided to switch and it just focused on Golden Queen's booty. It was very funny. It was very funny. Very funny. Because if you talk to the person who wants to play Sky Stones, whoever it is, the, it, depending on where you stand, it, it just focuses on Golden Queen's bum. <laughs> she wears leggings. Did you guys know that? Of course you did. You watched my one very random fact video. It talks about how she wears black leggings. Okay. Life Skylanders, alright, Chompy Mage. Every time I put the Chompy Mage, I'm going to say Chompy Mage. Chompy Power! I gotta say, that's one pr impression that I feel like I nail every time. I don't think there's a day that goes by that I don't go, I nail the Chompy Mage impression. Get him, boys. Get him, boys. See you later, boys. See you later, boys. See you, boys. See you later, boys. Oh, you didn't kill him! You didn't finish the drawbridge! That's a quote from Markiplier's The Forest playthrough, one of my most watched videos of all time. Not on my channel, but in general, I've watched that video so many times. So many chompies! We don't stand a chance! Oh, hey, buddy. <laughs> guess I'll do some work, I guess. <laughs> cool. Don't. 
No, 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 not happening, bro. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was legit ready to roll into him then to start using my roll move while the Chompies were messing him up, so. Woohoo! Wow. What a hard puzzle. Why is he squeaking? It's because of his shoes? Okay. I don't know. I don't know about that one. Okay, nerd. Ha <laughs> ha! Got him. <laughs> Didn't seem tough to me, bro. Air Skylands are stronger here, meaning that Zhuzhu is up. We only have one debut left, by the way. It just got very dark and dull in this room out of nowhere. Let me just... There we go. As I said, that's going to be the only move you're going to see from me. I've come to terms with it. You better too. That's all I know. It's all I know is you better. You guys better come to terms with it. I got to quickly fix this. This looks horrible in the background here. Ah, come back, you. Don't you show my closet. Oh, that won't go any further. That's why. Hold on. There we go. And I still got some light on me face here. It's, oh, it's snowing. It's snow. That's why it's so gloomy outside. Remember, I just I was like, it's getting gloomy some fat. It's because it's snowing? Is it actually sticking snow? Oh, it's kind of gross, though. All right, random snow, folks. Random snow, folks. Random snow, folks. Random snow, folks. There we go. It only took me literally four attempts to do that. But here we are, folks. Random snow, folks. <laughs> I don't understand why I kept falling down that hole. That's gonna be a good, that'd be a good random clipped upload on the channel at some point. <laughs> oh, excuse me. I'm gonna say I do like uploading random little videos on the channel. They seem to do the most popular sometimes. So, I mean, look at my most popular video of all time is. I didn't know my Skyliner portal could do this. Literally made me go viral a couple years ago. And that was a couple, literally a couple minute video where I just didn't know my portals linked together because of the near field communications. Because, again, I'm an idiot. Yeah, that's right. You tell, you tell me. Whoopa. You see this guy over here? See? Bonk. <laughs> I love that, how he just literally dies. So it looks like if nothing changes, I'm going to be facing off against the swashbuckler as bad juju. Alright, here we go. Yeah, unless there's going to be a change, which it probably won't be, I'm going to be facing off against the swashbuckling doomlander as bad juju, which... I don't know if that's a good thing or not. I'll be honest with you. I'm not too sure. Come here, you. There we go. <laughs> Back at it again. <laughs> Why would I use any other move? It actually shocks them, too, I just realized. So, like, they can, you know, stop. Look at this. Genius move this is. None of them's got even a hit on me. Now remember, it's usually these kinds of locks that I do when I find out that a character is good or not. However, I'm doing one move with Bad Juju this whole playthrough. I jokingly did the uh, the shock move just out of curiosity, so. But I mean, it could work with the Swashbuckler battle coming up here now. Because yes, it looks like I will be facing the... So yes, it looks like I will be... So yes, it looks like I will be facing the swashbuckling uh, Doomlander as Bad Juju. 
which should be interesting. I knew I would be facing some of my challenges with ones I actually don't like as much compared to like say Roblo, for example. So I knew it would happen, but I didn't I didn't want to. I do! That's why I'm playing as bad juju. Come on over, come on over. Oh, you moron! Idiot! 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 <laughs> look at this, look at this! Look at this, look at this! I can just set up a terrain trap here! Get away from me! Come here, come over here, come over here, come over here! Oh, you dummy! Oh, you actual idiot! Oh, you moron! Oh, you stupid, 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 naive summer child! Look at you! Look at this! How are you falling for this? You! Actual moron! Come here! Come here! Come here! Come on! Come here! Come on! Come on! Come on! Oh! Oh my! How is this happening right now? How is this working? <laughs> Get her, bad Juju Juju Junior! Juju 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 Junior! Is your name? <laughs> come here! Come on over! <laughs> How did that work? <laughs> when it comes to locks, I cheese the game. I always find a way, you know? I would always find a way. Is this just, how, I like the fact that that's actually, that was actually hurting him at the time, so. <laughs> yes, come on over, come on over. <laughs> you know what? Let's okay, let's 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 just okay, we're done with this now. Here we go. <laughs> what is this battle? Am I good at this game? Am I good with bad juju now? This is absolutely hilarious. This is this is hilarious. This shouldn't even be a ting what's happening right now. Eat up son, yummy. <laughs> what is this? Oh, it hit the thingy what an Idiot! Come on over, come on over. Oh, you. I can't believe how I beat him. I don't understand how I'm beating these guys in the way I am. <laughs> Boys, what just happened? <laughs> that was the wildest fight I think I ever had. We already had that one. That was the wildest fight I've ever had in the history of Skylanders. Like, did I even get hit? I don't even remember taking a hit that entire fight. Let me know in the comments. Crash, you did take a hit at this timestamp. Okay. Look, this is where we would hit, we're heading towards Sky Fortress, then towards the Guacamole monster. Guys, is that Bob's Burger voice actor? Dino Babalabalitz or whatever his name is? He's on Bob's Burgers, if you guys didn't know. He's done a couple of uh, voiceovers. He plays the candy cane truck driver in their Christmas episode, Christmas in the Car. And he also plays the um, the guy who runs the music shop in um, Drum Forgiven. Anyways, we're going to head to the Sky Fortress now, which I think is over this way. We'll figure it out. Ladies and gentlemen, we're going to head to the Sky Fortress there now for the next episode, which is literally in a couple seconds. Let's get into it. Let's go. 
All right, ladies and gentlemen, episode five. Here we go. We are halfway through the lock. Yeah, there's only 10 episodes. I apologize. But they're pretty long. Last two episodes were like almost 20 minutes. So, yeah. We're heading to the Sky Fortress. next. And this is what I'm actually worried about because if I remember correctly, the Doom Raider battle is the swords. Like the, the sword wielder, whatever they're called. Sword slinger. Sword class. What are they called? S sword. Swords. Knight! Knight class! Not the swords class, knight class. Tech Skylanders is trying in this game. Have you guys noticed still that we are five episodes in and we haven't had Buckshot debut yet? We haven't had Buckshot debut yet, which sucks. Um, gotta say, we are five episodes in. I am feeling very good right now. Um, of course, as I say, every episode does get harder and harder for the actual playing the game parts. And doing the Doomlanders, that's the only thing I'm actually really worried about, to be honest, is the Doomlander fights. So, yeah. Legit, the only thing I'm ever worried about is the Doomlander fights, so. Pew! Uh, how are you doing? Uh-oh, looks like a vulture battleship is heading our way. Yep. Let's go to the Anton Alright. Do I, do I have to? Do I have to, though? I like the fact that they literally kill themselves. Has anyone ever thought of this part, you know? Like, they're dead. They're dead now. They died. They've come in with the case of being dead. Here's my fun fact of the day. Did you know that you don't need to fight those guys? Just kidding. Bam, blam, 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 blam. Someone's gonna be like, wait, what? <laughs> I just gotta stand. I don't have to fight them. I'm just gonna stand here and shoot them. <laughs> I will cheese it every day of the week. I've told you a billion times. Woohoo, here we go. As I've said when it comes to me playing locks, I will cheese the locks every day of the week on... Oh, oh, okay, I was... What? Earth Skylander! Okay, why does it keep doing that? It like takes forever for it to actually switch and I'm standing there just like Cuz I can't really attack when I'm switching so There we go. I was like, "Where is the stupid scarab?" <laughs> yeah, one guy left. One guy left. One guy left. You missed, dummy. Idiot. There we go. I was attacking my scarab so it would give me extra hits. Oh, it's coming with me. Oh, it left. It left just like my Burger King did earlier. Fire Skylanders. All right, Ember, let's go. The joke here is that it's a poop. Fan the flames. Uh, uh, uh. Fan the flames. Okay. Heads up, Skylander. Oh, I gotta do the stupid Wrecking Ball minigame. How... Be honest with me. Honest to God truth. So there's a trophy where you actually have to destroy all the boxes with the Wrecking Ball. How many times... Dark Skylander, okay. How many times did you attempt that one before you actually got it? For me, it was a nice few. Especially on PS4. It was, for some reason, harder for me on this console than it was on the PS3 when I did it. The PS3, it took me a couple attempts. I think it was like two or three. But PS4, it took me like maybe five or six attempts to get it. And of course, there's going to be like, yeah, I got a first try, or yeah, I got it by accident. <laughs> I love when people are just like, I love when Crash just openly mocks us and demeans us. And I was like, yeah, <laughs> well, you earned it, buckos. That's what I say. <laughs> yoink and yoinkus. Woohoo. All right. But yeah, I, I don't do it in a condescending way. I do it as in, of course, there's going to be that one person because everyone talks about it. Like, geez, we got people in the comments being like, I just beat blah, blah, in nightmare mode oh, with just one Skylander. I'm like, okay. Like, not only do I not care, um, you're bragging about something that whatever. Like, no one really cares about it. Some people are better at games than you or you're better at games than them. Like, who cares, right? Yeah. Okay, I've never heard a single please in that entire sentence. 
Like, not even, like, are you able to come grab that, please? Like, guys, the Skylanders, the Skylanders are very rude. Hey, guys. So, was it Fire Element? Why didn't you say Fire Element? I was going to say I wasn't ready. Here we go. Fan the flames. A fan of the flames. She's Italian. Boingus, here we go. Come on over, come on over, idiot. Oh, I've been stupid. I'm an idiot. I'm the stupid. Where's he going? <laughs> Woohoo! Airstrike. No, I'm playing as Ember. Playing as, playing as Ember. Pretty interesting. I'm not playing as, um, what's it called? I'm not playing as Airstrike or, um, what's it called? Wildstorm. Wildstorm is one of my favorites. I love Wildstorm. Hey, buddy! <laughs> not playing as either of them, because Airstrike is, he's kind of meh. Not as meh as, um, of course, Bad Juju. But Wildstorm was one of my favorites. I love Wildstorm. Alright. First try. Let's see if I can do this. Oh my. Oh my. I got one ball right here. Come on. Let's get this little one. Yeah. Alright. Come back. Come back. Come back. One fell off the edge. One flat here. Does that count? Does that count? Here we go. Yes, here we go. Oh, I didn't hit. Oh, one fell off the edge. So that doesn't count, if I'm not mistaken. It's not going to pop up, obviously, because I have it, but. I missed one. Look, see? Oh. And I got that one. I think that actually counts, if I'm not mistaken. But one fell off the edge, so I don't know if that actually counts, so. I don't care. Kill. Just, just do it. Just bring it to the opposite platform. I really don't care. <laughs> Hi, Oinkus. Boing. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Oh, my. Oh, my. Oh, oh, my. Folks. Here we go. Hey, I got him. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Woo. Oh, another set. Hey, boom. I missed him completely. <laughs> clunk, clunk. <laughs> there we go. That's how you gotta do it. You gotta go just right and left with it. Womp. Womp. I've got the wrecking ball literally sitting on top of him. Oh, back we go. Really? I'm doing left and right because why not? <laughs> I've never. I'm, why am I swinging? I just realized my body is swinging. With it. Why am I doing that? <laughs> it's like when when you're playing like a racing game and you turn the controller. <laughs> what? Wow. No idea why we made these platforms so hard to jump on. He made he made a lot of sense though. I was seeing if there was some health over that way. I couldn't really clearly see anything, so I think there's gonna be an element change now anyway, so there's health over here though. Woohoo! Alright, here we go. Reach the hangover. Oh the hangar. The hangar. No change. Alright. Works for me, works for me. <laughs> first of all first of all doesn't doesn't matter if I die so like if I if I fall off the edge I just jump and try again you know wampus wampus now remember I can use my sky chi anytime water skylander oh gosh Oh, I got distracted for a second there trying to do life things. 
A watery grave awaits. Like, I don't care, bro. I don't care that a watery grave awaits. Clunk, clunk, clunk! Wonkus woo. Wampus woo. Eyeball. First thing we need to do to get the ship running again is to turn the engine off. Makes sense, right? What is this? Get the exclusive IGN bundle? What is this? I don't want any of those. Sorry, I got a, a, a an email from Humba Bumble. Tech Skylander. All right, still five episodes in. No magic debut. So you're telling? Wait, come I, I feel like when I did the Imagine Lock years and years years ago now, like literally it was my second ever lock, and this was like lock number like twenty something now probably. You're telling me that I never got to play a seesaw. I never got to play a seesaw until like maybe next episode. What it looks like because it does, does look like I'm doing an episode right now. He's gonna be in this episode. This is wild. You tell me, yeah, man. I gotta play the Celio Oscuro more. Like, that's insane. Like, I don't even feel like that's correct, you know? Perfect. Like, it had to have been, obviously, but. Like, it had to have been, but obviously. Well, it had to have been, but obviously. It didn't feel like it was. I didn't repeat my sentence then because I said it, I said it, I landed back on the platform, so I did it right. I'm no mathematician, but that just needs one more to go. I'm not a mathematician. Guys, you heard it here first. Jet fact does methamphetamines. They're bad. That's a bad thing. Work, Ooh! Now, no, 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 no. No, 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 homie. I see a chest up there. Your baby boy's going to get that. I need the chest. I'm not just playing the imagine or the, the the worst lock to just try to win. No, no, no. I want to finish. No, 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 baby boy. I'm trying to actually finish my collection here. I'm not just gonna be running around playing this game for. No, 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 baby boy. I'm not just trying to play the worst lock just because I can. No, no, no. I'm going to try to finish my collection. See if I can do this right this time. Let's go. And then up. And then up. Hey, Give me that chest, baby. And it's going to be a double. You ready? It's a duplicate. What a waste! Actual waste of time. Don't know why Jetvac was like, hey, you should go grab that. You guys you guys heard him, right? You heard him say it. He literally says, like, hey, you should go, you should go grab that, uh, you should go grab that magic chest over there, then meet me up front. Heard him say it. I get it. I heard you. I'm switching. A watery grave awaits. A watery grave awaits. Hey, it worked. And nothing seems broken. Bonus. Not going over there. Oh, he just fell off the edge there, but for some reason he did not. Get him, get him. Yeah, pour water on his face. Pour water on him. <laughs> I mean, I'm not... I wasn't the one I was trying to aim at the whole time. He just led me into that one. He just led me into that fight. Don't care. Don't care. Woohoo. Oh, come on, man. You're killing me here. All right. Is there any food in here? Light Skylanders? Oh, move. There we go. I always run around in a circle while I'm trying to get the Skylander off of the base. That's the other issue, is I'm always trying to get the Skylander off the base in the middle of a fight. And I'm just like, ah. <laughs> oh, he's glitched again. He's glitched again, folks. I will take this any day of the week. <laughs> I don't know why that happens. I legit don't know why it glitches out like that. But every day I will take that. Oh yeah? Buddy, I don't care. <laughs> Alright, let's push the little fan rocket over here. I think is it a rocket or is it a fan? I don't know. If you stand it depends on the side you're on. If you're on the back, it's a fan. If you're on the front, it's a rocket. <laughs> <laughs> Write that one down. That was that's one of my best quotes right there. 
If Crash the Skylands highlights was still a thing, that would be one he'd post. Or she'd post. I don't know who... Yeah, that's right, buddy. Boink. Boinkus. Boinkus. Okay, and whoop and whoop. There we go. Let's take it to the limit, to the tippity top. Your boy over here, Lock Master, the king of the locks. Call me a key, cause I be opening these locks. Don't call me a key. Hey, look, I opened the lock, just like a key would do. Probably did. Water. In a way, I'm not having me switching Grave Clobber because he has lost a lot of health. Luckily, there's going to be characters that will die up here, and I'll get some food from them, hopefully. I also got these, this here, too, so I can use that to my advantage, so. Woohoo! Can they... They're getting days when I do this. Oh gosh, okay, okay. This is not how I'm hoping it would go. Woohoo! Oh gosh! Yeah, okay, we're good, we're good. Little dudes over here. Excuse me, we gotta get them out of here somehow. Oh no! That's a lot of health! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Yes! Oh, I'm still very low on health. Very low on the health. We are running around avoiding everything under the moon right now. Oh gosh, I was not expecting the sadness right now with the multiple I'm about to die. There we go, get that geyser on the go. That should help a little bit. That should help a little bit. Oh, there's health. There's some health. There's some health. Let's get it. Yes, he got him. Geyser again. Got one geyser down. Got one guy down. I'm just coming in. I'm coming in. I'm coming in. I'm coming in. I'm coming in. Got one down. Come on, baby. Geyser. No. Geyser. Geyser! Oh my god, why are you not Geyser? Ring, 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 ring. There, Geyser. Come on, come on, come on. Get him. Big guy's down. Big guy is down. I repeat, ladies and gentlemen, big guy is down. Get away from me. Woo! <laughs> Your boy, I said it earlier, and I'll say it again. Your boy is literally the greatest at Deluxe. Oh my. Ladies and gentlemen, there's no way you can look at me and say that wasn't the smoothest move you have seen in your entire lifetime. I am literally the best. I don't know what I'm trying to do right now. You're watching literal hell happen at the moment, but I need that health. That's why I'm doing this. I did want to fall in there. Just. Oh man, I, there's no way to, I, I would have switched on death for literally four seconds. I wasn't hanging around over there. Guys, I don't understand how I just did that. I'm not even going to lie to you. That was the most intense moment I think I've had in a lock. Get here, you cub, you punk. Let me mess you up. Yeah, I'm not scared. I ain't scared anymore. I'm not scared of you. I'm terrified, but I'm not scared of you. I can't believe that just happened. Like, they hit- two of them hit me at the same exact time, so they but did a lot of damage to this issue. So... Um, so it looks like I'm gonna be facing the Knight Doomlander as Grave Clobber, and I'm only 500- ooh. Okay, looks like we're going to be using some Sky Chi this time. Yeah, because he's going to switch to Imaginite now, see? 
Imaginators. I almost had it. We're okay, we're okay. Geyser, geyser, geyser. Uh, uh, uh. Okay, we're gonna say I'm probably not a lot of talking from me in the, for the next little bit because you know, terrified to get come down with a case of being dead. So, we're gonna leave my um, Sky Chi for the la. Oh, I got hit that time. You ain't guess. All right, one down. I'm leaving the Sky Chi for the final one because I think that's probably the safest bet. I just do one hit every time when he does this big swing. I just do one hit. We're both huge. Have you noticed that? Both of us are massive. Okay, I can do three hits at a time. Looks like. If I if I get fast enough, I just gotta avoid his move every time. Again, not scared, just terrified. Oh, I hit a fourth by accident. I didn't mean to do a fourth. I was gonna say I can probably get away with a fourth, but I gotta be safe. That's the issue, right? Look, he's a close range one, so this is like a big close range. Oh, I got his head off. Yeah. Come on, Grave Clobber. You can do this, buddy. Don't care. Let's do this, baby. He's the wrecking ball one. Get hit, get hit. Oh! Oh! <laughs> He's the one with the wrecking ball. Yeah, I'm not going to lie. That did suck for you, buddy. That was brilliant. Good luck dealing with that. <laughs> Hold on. I just got a comment from probably the dumbest comment ever. So I just had to read. I just had to reply to that one because I was like, because it does pop up sometimes. I get a notification when I get comments. And that one there was probably the dumbest one. Someone asked him, still doing Skylander Rumbles? Like, I do one every year in August, and if you go to the channel, you would see that. Anyways. Oh. Level complete. Let's go, baby. I can't believe we almost lost Grave Clobber that time. I can't believe that I won the actual fight that time. I'm surprised. I'm very surprised. Wait, do I have to take on the guacamole monster? No, this ain't happening. Nope. Nope. We're cutting the episode off. We're not doing it. All right. We're just leaving. Can I just go back to I can return to the map? We're not taking on the guacamole monster. I don't care if you look at me saying like, Crash, that's, that's cheating. That's, that's not allowed. That's cheating. Whatever. It's first of all, my rules, my lock, my rules. But anyways, I'm not facing that for literally no reason. So we're going to cut to the next episode there now, which is, I forget, um, but it'll be the next episode. So I don't remember which one's next. Dragon Temple? One of them. You'll see in literally five seconds anyways. So see you in a moment. All right, ladies and gentlemen, it's Fizzland that's coming up now. I completely forgot. Uh, so I usually look ahead. I look at the thing and it tells me what's next. But yes, ladies and gentlemen, here we go. We are at episode six of the series continuing on here now let's get it going it's fizzland time fizzland. fizzland is a very interesting one i remember the first time playing this thought it was fantastic but it's one of those levels i look at and go oh man what a trog to come back through on a second playthrough not as bad as some other ones in my excuse me in my opinion but yeah this one's up there for sure 
My burp still tastes like garlic, if you guys are wondering. Thanks, Dino. Anyways, Golden Queen is popping out here now. We are six episodes in and still no Magic Skylanders unless I missed it. And I really hope you guys are ripping me apart in the comments if I somehow missed a magic spot. Because I thought I could skip that. I was like, why wouldn't it let me skip? Because I like the idea of Fizz Land, but like, come on, bro. Oh, uh, oh, uh, eyeball. Here we go. There we go. I know only grants one imaginary chest. I get them out of the way because it makes it easier for me to find where to go next. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Whoop. And whoop. Perfect. Probably. Life element. It's time for the jumpy mage. So, like, it's actually gotten really dark in the room. It doesn't look like because of the face cam. Like, it's because of the light and everything. Which is the light outside. But it's got, like, very gloomy in the, my room right now. In the office here, so. Can you... I... Come on, you. There we go. There's a couple of little fights in this area. I remember that's actually kind of... Kind of good. <laughs> that poor thing never stood a chance. <laughs> All the chompies and me rolling at it. I can say I'm actually like feeling weirdly confident with this. Now I don't remember. I didn't go. I don't go back and look at my other locks. That's my biggest thing. Is I don't go back and watch my other locks leading up to this one. So I don't remember how far I was in before I lost any Skylanders in the villain lock. But I don't remember. I think I thought it was. Because I do remember at one point Chaos died, so then I lost uh, Crankcase because of it. So. Fun fact, when... I'm dead. Here's your fun fact of the day. So I usually have my locks planned in advance. So I literally have a list on my phone what locks I'm going to do. So after this one's over, I'm going to actually look up the list and they'll tell me what the next lock is going to be. And that's the plan. However, uh, the biggest thing is I don't... Uh, I write a, who I'm going to be participating in the lock days or months in advance. So with this one, I originally had Dr. Crankcase as my tech Skylander. Until I played as Robo. Until I played as Robo. In uh, Honestly Half Hour. And ya boy changed his mind. Yes. Cause, so yeah. So Dr. Crankcase was my least favorite. Until I actually got to play as Robo. And realized wait he's severely overrated. He doesn't even seem powerful. Like that's the worst part. Is he doesn't even seem powerful. So like. What am I supposed to do? Nice. Woohoo. I somehow grabbed that through the gap, but I mean, that's fine. I don't need that one little diamond up there. Whoop. There we go. Hey, you did it. Got the old vacuum working again. Now let's get sucking. Oh my. Switch worlds to pick up different colored globules. I bet I have to. I like this minigame's kind of cute. Like, this is a cute little random side minigame kind of thing. Now, Look at them. Yep. Oh, oh, oh. Why is my camera doing this? Do you see it? Did you see it? I don't know. It wasn't glitching for you guys, I'm assuming. It was glitching for me. But, like, I guess it was, like, it was so dark for some reason just then. <laughs> I need to get, like, a light for my face. Maybe next episode. Oh man, I'm gonna have to break out the the lamp. In my what's it called? So I do have a ring light. I haven't used it in a while, but I guess with darker playthroughs now, especially by the time I actually record, I'm gonna have to use it more. So I'm gonna have to break that out next episode. I think it does make my face look good too. So like right now, I'm using the light from outside, but it's getting dark fast. 
these days. Like it's it's currently for it's 4:13 p.m. here in Newfoundland, is where I live. And right now it's actually getting dark out. So within the next hour it's going to be pitch black. Which is a bummer because like if you think about it, some parts during the day I'll actually wake up in the morning. My battery is low. Oh, I'm going to find the charger now too then, I guess. All right, next next episode is going to be wild. I'm going to have my controller charging. Oh, hold on two seconds. Camera's being glitchy again. There we go. Nope, still being very glitchy. What in the world is happening right now? Oh, didn't mean to do that. Hey, all right, that's going to have to work for now. Don't worry, next next episode I'll get that fixed. The camera's probably not glitching on your guys' end. Like, the video you're watching right now is probably perfectly fine, so... You're probably wondering what I'm talking about. But editing me, or currently recording me, sees this and goes, Oh man, my content doesn't look great. And that's coming from me, of all people, so... You know, it's gotta be bad. Good job, me. Not my smartest move, not my smartest move. You can see a weird little, like, kind of outdoor thing there now. You can't, you actually got to see my outdoor anyways, if you think about it, because of the fact that... You got to see my outdoors in a way... Wait, he don't know he hit it! How did he hit that? Who was even near it? Anyways, um, you got to see a little bit of my outside. Oh, it's still glitching out like crazy here. Alright, I'm gonna have to do a little bit of fixing now for two seconds there. Okay, hold on. Give me five seconds there. If I do this... You guys get to see my very cool trees outside my house. That's just for a little bit. That's going to be just for this episode. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, got to remember that hurts me. That's my problem with not paying full attention sometimes because of the fact that I, uh... Yeah, that's my problem with my not paying full attention to things is because I'm going to get hit real easy half the time here. Oh, gotta go back, gotta go back. Oh, God, gotta go back. Uh, uh. Nice. Oh, co oh, come on. There we go, come on. Can I push this ball into you and you die? Oh, you don't. Okay, that's fine. There we go. Oh, oh no. Wait, I don't need to fight you. What am I doing? Leave. You can't hit me while I'm in here. Ha, ha, ha. Ah, 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 ah. So the issue is the lighting. The only issue is that the lighting, when it goes dark, goes all glitchy on me too, so. There we go. Cool. Didn't need to get the, the gem. Didn't need it. There we go. Oh no, do I have to go? Oh no, okay, I was gonna say, like, do I have to go all the way back now? Come on, we need it. We hilariously... Yes, I was just going to say, we need an element switch right now. It is so dark in my room right now because it's snowing again. Is it like sticking snow? It is. The snow is sticking. So, I'm sorry I keep getting distracted by the face cam, but I mean, the face cam is a key aspect of this, of you getting to see me. But don't worry, next episode I will have that fixed, and by next episode it will be at the end of this one. This enhancement testing area. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I'm playing as Grave Clobber in this area. We got the boy, as we call him. Yoinkus, 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 bunk. Come on, you. Oh, come on, you. Come on, you. Yes. Woohoo! Wampus woo, baby. Wampus woo. Oh, man, the lighting. I'm glitching around so bad right now. Oh man, I might have to just get up and turn on my light for now. Okay, we're gonna have to. I gotta, I gotta fix this face cam. Don't worry about this. This is just me preemptively worrying about life. Give me a second. Ready for a lighting change? Look at that. That's gonna work for now. This is not going to be permanent. I'm going to change it now when we're done this episode. Look, you can see the snow! You can see the snow in the video! Look at that! Yeah, you can see the snow. All right, this is gonna be just for this episode. We're gonna fix it again next, we're gonna fix it in the next one. I mean, I can leave it like this. I don't see why not. It looks good. Okay, screw this. I'm not wasting my time. We got the Sky Chi, we're allowed to use it as per the rules that I made for my lock in my series. Oh, 
Oh, I was gonna say, I'm like, what happened? But oh yeah, there's Big Bubble Boy. Big Bubble Boy over here. I'm not scared of you, Big Bubble Boy. Boink, 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 boink. Go and be honest with you, don't know what happened there, but I'm totally okay with it. I mean, this is probably going to be the way I can keep the lighting, because even then I can close my blinds like this, right? And I can still kind of see. Uh, the lighting in my face is a little bit weird. Uh, I'll still probably break out the light in a moment. Next episode. We'll get it all fixed next episode, so I'll take a little break in between for myself, you know? Oh, there we go. Yoinkus. Did I get it? I did. Okay. Whoop! I was gonna. I think I overshot that one, but I did not. There we go. We're doing well with this. So. Unless there's an element change between now and, like, in the next battle, then it looks like I'm taking on the next Doomlander as Graveclobber, which is the ninja class, I think? I think it's the ninja class? So, like, that's going to be interesting. Whoa. Are you some kind of chemistry major or I am, yep. Yeah, that was super genius sorting right there. That was. Oh, we just watched a mash. Tech Skylander, wait. Am I facing the ninja as Robo? I'm not sure about this one, folks. I'll be completely honest with you there. Those one. Where did one? How did one red one get in there? How did one red one get in there? Oh, must have been at the end, maybe. That poor one just standing by itself there. Alright, here we go. So it looks like I'm gonna be... Air, Air Skylanders? Okay. So I'm facing off the ninjas. I don't know. I cheese the swashbuckling one with bad juju, so I will gladly do it again. Oh! Good job, me. Good job, me. Good job, me. Got to. I, I've come to terms realizing that I'm not very good with bad juju, with landing on platforms. <laughs> but yes, looks like we're being bad juju in this battle with the ninja class. So this should be interesting. You can- oh, wow, okay, you're not even moving. You're just gonna stay there in that one spot, are you? <laughs> Get him, Juju Jr. <laughs> Wait, can I hold it down? Is that a movie has? It is a movie has! Okay. That's oh I didn't know I could hold it down, bro. You're okay, buddy. There you go. Can I hit you from here? Oh I can. No, I can't. Never mind. Oh, look at this. Oh man, I didn't know I could hold triangle. Oh I oh, I did the mark on my face. Ooh, that hurt. Okay. This is I know I don't remember where hers is. Wow.
Made a mistake, made a mistake. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Oh, man. Oh, no. Yo, I'm going to lose. I'm losing bad juju. I'm losing bad juju. It's happening. Guys, I'm losing bad juju. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. No, 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 no. I made a mistake. Oh, gosh. It doesn't hit him. Gosh. Oh, she gone. Yeah. I wasn't sure how to approach that one, I'll be honest. Because, like, the first two was good because I could push him there and hit the lightning down. But, like, the fact that he kept moving, I didn't know as much I can do. So, I'm, st I'm actually sorry, Bad Juju. I'm really sorry. We're not being undefeated in this lock. But I think it's time for the Chompy Power. Yeah. That's a bummer. That's a bummer I lost uh, I lost Bad Juju. I was actually kind of enjoying that fight. It's not going to lie. NGL, as the kids would say. NGL. <laughs> Same, actually. Gotcha. Woohoo! I mean, it's a bummer I lost bad juju, but I mean, nothing, nothing I can do about it. I gotta move on. Ah! Beard haircut. Oh well. No perfect streak for this one. That is perfectly fine. Losing bad juju, it doesn't, to me, doesn't feel like, you know, the worst thing in the world. I was enjoying using the Juju Jr. move properly. Probably, but. Yep. Oh, God. Oh, that thing. Oh, that silly boy. <laughs> Alright, ladies and gentlemen, that's going to do it for this one. Another episode down. Oh, we got a cutscene. I'm gonna skip. I'm gonna skip this cutscene, don't you worry. Mm -hmm. There we go. Alright, so next is the Golden Arcade, ladies and gentlemen. Very excited to bring you that one, which is literally right down the hill here. So yes, come back in literally a couple seconds to watch me attempt the Golden Arcade, which the fight with Chaos, or the Doom Lander in that one, is gonna be a little tough too. So this should be an interesting one. Let's get started on it in about four seconds. Here we are, ladies and gentlemen, episode 7. We gotta give a quick moment of silence for Bad Juju getting defeated in the last episode. And there we go. Bad Juju got defeated. I'm actually kind of bummed about it. I was kind of enjoying playing as Bad Juju just because of the weird mechanics of shooting Juju Jr. at him. So, this is where you go, oh, Crash, does that mean you like Bad Juju? No, no. I mean, I'm getting, I got to know him, her better. But as you can see, it's hard to fight certain things with her. But, I mean, any enemies like that. Let's get to the Golden Arcade. The Golden, the golden Arcade. Ooh, that mark on my face is really bad. I'm assuming you guys can see that plain as day. Um, I don't know where this came from. It was last Saturday. Yeah, it was Saturday when I got this. Today is Wednesday, me recording this. And this has just been here. Just a random mark on my face. Does have me. I hear some weird like noise in the background. I don't know if that's you guys or like you guys can hear that. Hold on, I gotta check something real quick. It is. Okay, so good news. I can't keep that plugged in there, so I'm gonna have to change that next episode. Oh, never mind. The noise has stopped. It was this weird like noise happening, but it's not happening now. So. Because um, I have the I have the ring light on. I found my ring light. Like, if you look at my glasses. Oh, there it is. Oh, there's the ring light. Um, so I have the ring light on now. I found my old one with it. And I have it set up. And it's got a good light, bit, a bit of lighting on my face here now. So it mixes with my in-room lighting too. Which is good. Because I have two great bulbs up there. Let us in, you big meanie. 
Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him, get him with the ball mode, ball mode, ball mode. Wait, I gotta be careful with ball mode if I get in front of him. Ooh! The rats, they have died. Doorbells? I hate doorbells. Every dog ever. <laughs> oh, it's back. Never mind, that noise is back. Okay. I'm assuming you guys can't hear it. This is, can, if I turn this off, how bad does it look? Oh, like nothing right now. Okay, so I can easily adjust this later. Okay! The right now, the lighting's actually decent. I would like a little bit more light on my face, obviously. But, like, there's that weird pee -pee -pee noise in the back. Now, here's the thing. I just realized. It's not for you. It's not you guys. Weirdly, the, uh... I can change the color of the light. There we go. Depending on the, uh, the amount I have it set at, there's just this weird noise in the background. <laughs> For me, it's not gonna, I'm assuming you guys can't hear it at all. If you can, if you hear this weird, like, noise throughout the whole episode, let me know. Editing me is also going to see it, or hear it, so. It shouldn't, though. I think it's just the TV. So weird. It's so weird. The TV I have is really old, I'll be honest with you. So, like, it likes to make weird noises sometimes. I'm also trying to ignore the fact that they they did trigger Happy Dirty like that. I don't care. But jeez, Jingle Bell chopping me. Guys, it's been the tech home the whole time, hasn't it? I've been so distracted by that weird noise that, like, I didn't pay full attention. I'm just turning it off. Whatever. Future me will worry about that now. Next episode. I'll get that fixed. But yeah, I, uh, Chopping Mage lost a ton of health. I was supposed to be tech home the whole time. I also don't like the fact that Trigger Happy talks like that. So... <laughs> Whatever. I'm singing, singing a song. Oh, I need to have the light on because it's, it's making a little bit of delay. Alright, whatever. I'm going to have to ignore the noise. Okay, whatever. Don't care. See, like, Golden Arcade is fantastic the first time around. When you play Golden Arcade for the first time, you have an actual blast. I don't think there's anybody out there who loves, who hated it. But man, playing it for a second time. Trying to get through all these little odds and ends just so you can get to the final battle. Brutal. And then you misclick like I did. Then, then you misclick and then they screws you right up. Go Barbella in the corner here. I like to get a bunch of uh, Skylander YouTubers together and do a Skystones tournament. I think that'd be super cool. Everybody tag your favorite Skytuber in the comments. There used to be an online. I remember way back in the day. There used to actually be a play place where you can play Skystones online. Was there? I think there was. From what I remember, there was, so... Sweet. Don't know why he put Hood Sickle there, but okay. No, I think you're just bad at us. What it is? Do 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 do. Ooh ooh ooh! We're gonna go grab ourselves a snail. Was there a snail last episode? I don't remember the snail in Fizzland. I don't remember there one being at all. Anyways. I know the one in Dragon Shores is like literally on the way. Like you have to actually follow it to get to the next part. So like, that wasn't a new one. Here we go. Let's get to the duck shooting. So this is where all the major players start. Okay. Yep. Wump. Wump. Here we go. Come on, you. There we go. Well, if I played it 40 billion times, it's usually a little bit easier. There we go. Alright. What a trog! It was, yes. Yeah. 
step on the path to enlightenment is to shoot these spinning targets and lower each platform. <laughs> Had to go out of my way for a second there. It's funny, I didn't know that area was there the first time I played it. Like, if you go back to my imaginative playthrough, I don't, I didn't shoot that thing. Did not know it was there. Woohoo! This is not the first time you've shot targets to lower a platform. It's not! It is, it's really not! I've done it at least 45 times. Okay, Mr. Bossy. Oh, okay, there we go, Womp. I love that little Easter egg there with the, uh, with the, whatever it's called, overdrive chest. Woohoo! Got it, baby. Rolls do. It's just like elevator music. Like I'm, I'm sitting in an elevator right now. Standing in an elevator. You don't sit in elevators. That'd be weird. Imagine if you... Think about it. If you open up an elevator door, open up, and you saw a guy sitting on a chair in there, wouldn't you be freaked out? See? There we go. That's exactly what I was holding right the entire time. Don't care. I don't care. We're going to open all the chests at the end of the playthrough regardless. So, like... I like if you guys skip all the way to the end, you'll skip to the end to see me open up Imaginate Chess and be like, did he win or not? Light Skylanders! Alright. Oh, her car won't start up again, guys. Oh, yeah? Don't care, don't care, don't care, don't care. Trying to get through this, trying to get through this, trying to get through this. Here we go. What a trog this one is, man. Like, I love this level. It's a great level. Absolutely one that I fully enjoy to, like, the, the Mizax. But, like, man, playing this one, again, for, like, the lock is Berhutol. Bye, Juju. He's gonna do top right. Oh. Oh wait, no, you can put them there. I was just I'm like, I'm like, why is that working for him? That shouldn't have worked, but I forgot that you can do that in this game. It doesn't completely break it like Giants does. Wild Storm. <laughs> <coughs> <coughs> oh. Choked a little there, and when I growled. <coughs> We won by one, though. Aurora. I will take the one by one. Oh! Why did that one hurt my throat? That's not normal for me. You know what's funny? I don't think he ever figures out to get it off. Yeah. This dude's just gonna try to kill me the whole time. Hilarious. Come and get me, bro. Come and get me, Womp. Oh. Oh, big money, big money, big money. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. Oh, I win! It's almost like it's planned. Oh, sorry about that, bro, Chacho. Yeah, you know what, dude? I'm not even gonna lie, I deserve that one. <laughs> not gonna lie, I deserve to be hit that time. I did kill your brother. I'm assuming it's your brother. Sibling. I won again! God, I'm... He 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 he, she says. They get it? 
Or am I too far away for some apparent reason? Nope, we did it. All right. You sure can't, Aurora. Aurora, 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 Aurora. All right, good job, me. Falling off the edge there. Hint, jump on button, buddy. I don't need your hint. Trust me. <laughs> Do not need your hint. I, I could have figured that one out myself. But of course, me, I just falled it off the edge instead. Because, you know, idiot over here. Ooh, look at that. If that was bad juju. She would have fell at least 14 times. All oh, right, right. There we go. Thank yous. All right. Finally getting to an actual part of this level. Because, like, most of this level is just, like, fun arcade adventures, really. Wee. Is this actually a yoga pose? Enough, we have reached the final test of this golden arcade. Oh. One so diabolically feated, it can only take the form of a video game. Yep. Candy cake gumdrop land. Please feel free to give it a shot <laughs> if you dare. Of course, there are many others who want to play the game too. So you'll need Yoinkus. to Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Where are you? Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Wait. What am I doing? Yeah, here we go. I beat him. Oh, never mind. Okay. Woohoo. I will use the Sky Cheese. I don't care for some reason. I don't know why. People are just like, oh, you shouldn't use the Sky Cheese. That's cheating. How am I cheating in the lock I invented? How do you dictate the rules of the lock that I invented? You know how I scored there, by the way? That's me. The high score is me. I did it. <laughs> I gotta face another Aurora though, so this should be interesting. I'll be honest, I may lose Aurora this in this battle. This is a good tactic. <laughs> Bunch of hits. Jump past them real quick. Do it all again. I gotta get down on the ground though, because it doesn't look like I do a lot of. I don't do much damage when I do the jump. Yeah, I guess so. Whoop! Whoopa! This is where I last chime time, you know, back in the day. In my Imagine Lock, if I'm not mistaken, I lost him to the Smasher Doomlander. <laughs> I mean, it would be probably better if I got him on a straight terrain so I don't have to keep jumping back and up every single time. Hey, you're quite the gamer, aren't you? I am a gamer. Come on over. Come over here, buddy. Come over here. Initiate Berserker Rampage. This sky loser looks like they could use a good smashing, eh, Smasher? Hi, yeah. Yeah. In your face. Oh. Jeez. 
she's so fast. Her moves are so fast, bro. I love this. Whoop! That could have been nasty. Ooh! Don't know how I did. I avoided that one. All right, now we got the fire. Uh, what's they called? The fire peoples now. I should probably go take them out first, actually, come to think of it. So we'll go over here real quick and try to take them out. Oh, I can't hit them. Oh, bummer. Okay, okay. That's, doesn't, that's not cool. Oh, come on. I can't even hit the fire guys. This doesn't seem fair at all, bro. Oh! She's only, she's only 12. It's only 12. Are you down? What is this? Like, why are you in the air? Like, I don't, I don't find that fair at all. That was just my, that was stupid. Remember I said, I'm like, oh, I'm probably not going to win with Aurora. I was joking. I was joking, and then the game's like, oh, uh, great, I decided you're not going to win with Aurora. I've, uh, I've, I've decided for you. You know what? It's seven episodes. He hasn't made a debut at all. This is ridiculous. Here's Buckshot's debut, folks. We're debuting with Buckshot in the Golden Arcade. The Magic Element has not popped up literally once in this entire playthrough. This is Buckshot's debut, folks. This is Buckshot's debut, okay? Oh my gosh! What is this? Come on, buddy, come on, buddy, come on. Oop. I can jump over his head perfectly, which is great, but like... Up. But then that fireball, for some reason, knows exactly where I'm going to land every time, which is trash. How does the fireball know where I'm going to land every time? Yet you can't kill him at all. You can't shoot the fire element guy, the wizard, because he's in the air. You can't hit him. So then you have to realize to avoid the fireballs. But for some reason, the fireball can then land perfectly where you're landing. How does it know that? This is stupid. This is stupid. Buckshot's debut and he dies due to the game being weird. I don't understand that. How does the fireball know where to go? That was actually rage inducing. That was me legitimately upset with how stupid that was. The fact you can't defeat the fire dudes, they're so high up in the air. Like all the other enemies you can hit perfectly, but not that fire dude for some reason. That one fire dude, the other one was down below. <sighs> stupid. Lost both Aurora and Buckshot due to stupidity. And it wasn't my stupidity. Good for you. Well, there's still seven left. There's still only there's three it's still three more levels. We're okay. Don't care. Come on. Get this over with, please. I hate this level so much sometimes. Simply break the locks. Yeah. Why aren't you letting me skip, bro? Why aren't you letting me skip? I wanna get this over with. I'm sick and tired of this level. Come on. Man, oh man. Imaginator sucks, bro. Imagine, though, like, I would beat the, dry, the arcade. 
And imagine if I had to do the stupid cake missions. I think I'd actually be more furious than I already am. Yep. Call Blam. I've made a mistake. So why don't you come down here to thank the Skylander and myself for freeing you? Well, that would be the polite thing to do, wouldn't it? Hmm. Nah. Gotta find chaos instead. Bye bye. Oh, I'm, I'm guessing that wasn't the result you were hoping for. But hey, you're still the best player we've ever had at this arcade. And I'm sure you'll catch up with that brain fellow later, right? Level complete. That was the dumbest thing to ever happen. Whatever, 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 whatever. I'm over it now. Whatever, whatever. Come on, whatever. All right, let's head to Dragon Shores now, or Dragon Temple, or whatever it's called. Let's head to the next level. Anyways, it's going to be the next episode. I'm going to be back to my cheery self. I promise. I'm going to go take a breather now. I'm going to figure out why this buzzing noise is happening. We'll get it all fixed. Stupid, stupid level, stupid fight, stupid everything. Let's go. All right, I'm not, it's out of me now. Let's get to the next level. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. My energy is back to normal. I went and had a quick breather. We are ready for some Dragon Temple what I just said. This was going to be a hard one. From what I remember, the fight with the Doom Lander at the battle, the end is going to be tough. Um, I know that for a fact. So I'm ready for that one. Um, the thing is, is like if you look back at the Smasher battle, that battle actually wasn't tough. It was the fact that the fire dudes keep hitting you and hit you directly every single time for some apparent reason. Uh, tell you, what, I'm gonna go see if I can you get a Barbarian at the gate here, though, so that's pretty fun. Oh. Stretching me back out real quick while I quickly adjust the microphone. There we go. Come here real quick. Come here. Idiot. He didn't die. I think it's probably the expert mode, maybe. Was he supposed to die? I think depending on the difficulty, he's supposed to die. Nightmare mode, he just looks at and goes, and walks past it. Oh, I can still use life. Who is dead? Magic, light, and air. All right, I remember that. Magic never actually had an official debut. Like, legit, I did I miss it? Or is, is there no magic element in this game? Like, do you get shafted? How did I not play a seaside this whole time, if you think about it? Like, how in this entire playthrough, when I did the... I'm going to have to, like, look back at it. When I edit this, if you guys have did see... 100%, if you guys did say see a magic element, and I, for some reason, didn't switch it, or didn't see it or say anything... Then call me out, please, because like I was, I, it's not supposed to, it's not supposed to be a thing. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm an idiot. It said life element. I'm playing as Robo. Call me out on that one too. I'm literally the dumbest person in the world. I'm still thrown off from losing Aurora and Buckshot just then. So like that's probably why. I don't know, guys. I'm I'm losing it. Oh, can you not? Can you guys come over here real quick? Can when you guys can you when you guys come over here real quick? Can when, can when, can, when you, can when you guys come over here real quick? Can, can you? Okay, that's totally what I wanted. That's 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 what I wanted. That's what actually this come to think of it, that's exactly what I wanted. What just happened there? Oh gosh, come on. Ugh. This is where I lost potted chance, if I'm not mistaken, in my Imaginite playthrough. Or imagine lock. Sorry. Get him, boys. Let's go, girls. Oh, I didn't kill you yet. Come on, Chompies. Get him, boys. 
Woohoo! All right, come on, barbar barbarian. No, we're doing right. You can't hurt me when I'm in Sai Chi mode, idiot. Woo! Woo! Get him, Chompies! Get him, Chompies! Yeah! Sky Chi! Eh, 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 eh,
Does that mean? Boom boom. Cool. Boom boom's great. Starcast. Yes. Is she my favorite life? Because there's crap. Yeah. Boom boom is my favorite life. So if we do the best luck, like my favorites, you're going to see boom boom. I want right on. <sighs> Neo, Neo Gortex. Excellent. Excellent. Nice. Okay. We win. <laughs> right on. Champy right mage. All right. You have good I sure do. See, like, why would you choose brawn in the lock? You know? Unless you're doing a fight everything lock. Can't change, unfortunately, if it's an Air Skylander, because our Air Skylander is dead. But yeah. Why would you choose the Brawn in a lock? If you want your Skylanders to survive, why would you choose the fight? However, there is like a, I guess like a sub-rule lock you can do, um, where you have to fight everything. Like, you can't avoid fights, because people decide to do that for some reason, even though the whole point of a lock is to just win. The literal point of a lock is to win the lock. It doesn't matter how you do it. All that matters is that you do it. Which uh, which one is this? The brown one? No, it's that one. Okay. I forgot which one was. Yeah, like the whole point of a lock is to win the lock. It doesn't matter how you win it as long as you win the lock, right? It's all that matters. Boinkus. So for me, I'm going to choose the brain every single time for that one because of the fact that, you know, I don't care about fighting things. My goal is to get to the end with as many Skylanders as I can. I gotta remember there's Sky Cheese too. I just remember that too. Oh. Air element. Can't switch though. The, this, the dude just standing in front of me. That's hilarious. You're not supposed to be doing that. Oh wait, that's oh that's not what I wanted. Oh that's not what I wanted. Oh that's not what I wanted. Oh, what, I wanted. what the? Why can you hit me in the air? Oh my! Food, 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 food. Oh, a barbarian, of course. Along with Champos. Two barbarians, of course. Why Why not? Why not, right? Why not? I, I got a great... Did I just get one shot by that barbarian? I just got one... I basically, like, I had, like, half health. And he one-shot me. Well, Robo, you, 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 did, you did a thing, I guess. I don't think I'm. I don't know if I can make it to chaos. That'd be great, but like I, I, I don't have the hope right now. I tell you, tell you what, buddy. I tell you. Okay, screw. That was one. She was full health, and a regular enemy just did 194 down to my damage. What in the world is this game, bro? Like, if one of them hit me, I'm dead again. Like, if one of them hit me, I'm dead. One of these regular enemies. Come on, bro. There. And now I gotta... Oh, now I gotta face the stupid Doomlander. Like, how could you not get mad at a game like this? Why in the world would you make a game so difficult? Why would anyone want to play a game as difficult as this, man? Like, I was full health. And then a regular enemy hit me. A regular enemy hit me. Regular. 
Okay. I'm gonna lose Ember now anyways. So, like, who... Who cares, right? Like, I'm gonna lose Ember. Not sure how I can fight Chaos with um, a bunch of close-range fighters. Ember has a, a move where, like, if she's about to die, she can survive, right? Right? Is that a thing? If Ember's about to be defeated, she instead gains a shield and blocks all damage for 10 seconds. It'll be activated once per level. Oh, yes, she does! Or it doesn't work! Or you just don't get that! Or it doesn't happen! This game's stupid, bro. This game is stupid. Like, actually, this game is stupid. I don't know, man. I might have to start playing all of the games on regular difficulty so I don't get angry at the garbage they give us for, like, these fights here, man. Like, actual trash. Like, I'm close range. How do I avoid this... How do I avoid that? I don't know, man. I don't. I, you know what? There's no point. There's no point to even care anymore, man. There's literally no point to care. Thanks, game. Thanks, man. One of that. Oh, come on. Thanks, camera angle. So stupid. So stupid. So stupid. Like nothing else I can do. He's gonna die. I'm gonna lose. I'm gonna lose Hoodsickle. Yeah, last Hoodsickle. There he goes. For some reason, this move likes to sometimes hit him perfectly and then most times go, you know what, I'm just going to go the opposite way. And then God forbid the camera doesn't go properly either. Oh, I have an unknown caller calling me. Clearly, I'm not answering that. <laughs> you, you know what, I'm getting pretty sick of watching you win too. I'll be honest with you there. Oh, oh my. Ugh. Another one dead, of course. There's no one else I can really work with. There we go. I reign supreme. supreme. Golden queen time. There we go. All right, golden queen. There we go. Next one down. Oh, yeah! How many, excuse me, how many of these can I put down? Let's see. Golden Queen, though, might actually have a chance. Yeah, get him scared. Oh, the Scarab doesn't really do anything, really. I'll be honest with you there. Ooh, here we go, here we go. Wait, what am I doing? This is an easy way to... This is a good thing to do. Uh, of course. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Here we go, here we go.
I'm slow. Oh, he did the stupid thing on me again. That's what it was. The, the, the little dude over here. Is he dead? Is he dead? I walked right in. I'm walking right into these because, God forbid, I actually, like, aim properly. Oh, man. Guys, like, come on. How do you guys enjoy this game? How do you enjoy playing Imaginators on any difficulty that isn't, a no isn't normal difficulty? Oh, man. Oh, come on, bro. And we got some more of these dudes coming out here now. Of course. And, of course, none of these guys are going to actually give me health, too. God forbid they actually give me health if I defeat them. I don't know how I'm surviving this long, I'll be honest. I'm just running around in circles just trying to kill something. There it is. Alright. Cool! Guys, it's game over, bro. It always happens like this. Yeah. This is going to be another game that I'm going to switch to and to just keep on regular difficulty. This game is already hard as enough, for good lord. There's the third. We just defeated one of them. And a third one just came back out. Like, come on, bro. My health is almost completely gone. Where am I? There I am. The camera angle, bro, man. It's not... I walked right into the bullet because I couldn't see it because of the stupid camera angle. We got two left, so there's, you know, I've given up. I've given up. I've given up. I, you know, this is, this is how it goes. This is how it goes for me. I forgot about Imaginators when I just decide to give up. Because whatever, what actually ever. Mm-hmm. There isn't nothing I can do to stop you. I got two I got two Skylanders left. They're both close range attackers. For love of God, your super chaos, you need to have range attackers. Because you can't fight them normally for some apparent reason. So like Oh my, whatever. Looks like I'm gonna lose this battle in the exact same level that I did in the first one. Yep. Even better, they say they can fix all this brainwashing. Mm -hmm. According to the legend, our dragon magic is the only thing that can reverse the power of the ancient brain. But of course, no dragon has attempted this in thousands and thousands of years. Whoa, really? Oh. Um... Okie dokie. I guess that is what we're doing. Oh. Um... Why couldn't they have done that earlier? I know you couldn't find them, but... Well, Skylander, now that we've unbrainwashed everybody, <laughs> it's time to finally go after Chaos and take down that little pipsqueak once and for all. But first, why not try out the new Dragon Wings? See what it's like to be one of the cool kids. Wow. Do I have to, though? I mean, to, to beat the actual level, I have to, but, I mean, I will do that now. <sighs> like, guys, I hate being negative. You will know that. I've been through this many of times. I hate the fact that I get so negative in some of the, with these levels in these games. But, like, man, why do anybody choose a different difficulty? Why do people look at this game and go, I got an idea. Let's play on the hardest difficulty, because that's fun. Like, no. I'm also pressing circle every time so I can drop down faster. So I can get to the end down here. But for some reason, she likes to just do a spin attack every time. Because that's completely normal. <laughs> yeah, again, I hate being negative. I really, truly hate being negative about it. But man, oh man. The difficulty for no reason when they decide to increase it is insane. Like, actually insane. So, like, I don't think... I think this is my epiphany. In the new year, I'm going to start doing every lock on the regular difficulty. 
except for Superchargers and Swap Force. That's the only two games I know for a fact that I can beat with that with the harder difficulty. And that counts for Giants too, 100%. Giants is hard for some reason too. So yeah, from now on, I'm just going to do the levels as regular as a regular playthrough kind of thing. And just if they die, they die. I'm just bad at the game. I don't care anymore. I'm tired of having a random challenge for no reason. Speaking of random challenges, let's go to the abandoned amusement park. Let's see if I can beat this game with just two characters. I won't, but I'll try. So let's cut to the next episode there now. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen, episode nine here. Two episodes left, hopefully. I'm um, going to be honest, I only got two scholars left with Chopscotch and Grave Clobber. And as much as I am good with both of those guys, I don't know. The quick shot battle is going to be kind of tough, but... Let's waste no more time and go into the abandoned music part. But yes, I stick to what I said in the last episode, which was only a couple seconds ago. I am forever going to be playing Trap Team and Imaginators on uh, regular difficulty. Giants I'll probably play on harder difficulty. I realized after I came to think of it, Giants difficulty is not as bad as, it th as I thought it was. But Swap Force and Superchargers, 100% I'll be playing on harder difficulty, so... Yeah, because I forgot this game has some garbage mechanics that uh, like to really screw you up in the end. And that's why we're here. And that's why we're here. Ooh, spooky. They look like my face. Be aware that falling skulls are not part of the park's attractions. We have uh, no idea how they got here. Still the creepiest thing in Skyline, if you think about it. Like, why? 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 <laughs> Can't switch. Now, if it was Grave Clobber's old element, sure. I only have Undead and Water left now, so. But, I mean, I think I'm going to be okay. I'm going to get to the Doomlander battle. That's my plan. I'm getting to the Doomlander battle. But that's going to be it. Oh, excuse me. Move the octopus. That's my plan. That's why I'm here. They may wonder why I'm quoting that. That's from Star Wars. Same scene as Visible Confusion, if I'm not mistaken. Whoop. Look at that. See, it looks a shortcut. I was like, how is that a shortcut? Woohoo! All right, here we go, Chop Scotch. You can do it, girl. <laughs> oh, water, water element, water element. We're getting over here and switching. I can make the rules. I don't care. All right. Grave Clobber is up and at um. A watery grave awaits, he says. A watery grave awaits, ladies and gentlemen. All right, here we go. Grave Clobber in this now. Thank, thank you. Let's just head down here. Oh, wait, no, I need to push that over. I was like, oh, why don't I just walk down here and get it started? No, I need to push a thing down. Whoop. There we go. You're welcome. Boink, boink, boink. I was going to say, I'm doing my best to, like, speed through this, right? But I'm like, I should take out those guys because if I'm trying to push myself through this, I'm probably going to get caught by them. That's the biggest issue, right? I'm not facing you guys. Who's going to stop and let myself get killed by them? <laughs> Can't switch, unfortunately. Chompy Mage somehow died. Or I can just do it. Nope. It isn't, actually. Now, the next ooh, 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 look at him. He looks like he's going to fall. He's like, oh, oh I'm going to fall. Oh, I'm going to fall. Ooh, 
Oop, there we go. There we go. Since so, yeah, I thought I thought it was the top part. All right, folks. I'm getting through the frosting part because the cake part is still like the stupidest thing about this game. But oh yeah, the great debate: frosting or icing. Remember, I remember that one. I bring that up every time. I just realized. I think every time that we do Imaginators, I talk about the great frosting and icing debate that I had in one of my uh, in my playthrough. I think it was, or was it the the Imagine Lock? One of the one of the things. It was either the the playthrough or the lock. One of the two. Oh, it's the top, isn't it? It is the top. Is it top? What am I missing? Where am I missing? Is it is it that? Oh, somehow he got that edge. I didn't even know they could get down there. No, I'm good. So dumb. The cake missions, including this one, is dumb. Still so dumb. All right, let's go. Let's go kill them all. Let's go kill everything. Commit mass murder, murder, if you will. All right, come here, you nerds. Oh, God, come on. Come on, I don't care anymore. I legit don't care anymore. No, I don't care. Yeah, I've given up. Don't, don't look at me like that. Say this is not enjoyable, whatever. I've given up. I don't care. <laughs> You skip to the end anyways, and you realize that I gave up, and you're just like, classic crash, just giving up like always. Yep. No, when the game becomes needlessly difficult for no reason, even on expert difficulty, like, come on, you gotta be kidding me. Like, jeez, I should have lied to you and switched it back to regular difficulty. Like, I should have, that would have been a great idea, but no, no, I can't do that, I have dignity, I have, I have want to be, you know, show I'm actually good at this. But whatever, whatevs, whatever anymore. <laughs> this move hits them in the air, though, so that's pretty sick, I didn't know that. Because I don't think we're done yet. Is he going to come down, please? Can he come down? Cool. The shock just completely missed that thing, but whatever. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> whatever. Whatever anymore. Whatever. Like, legit whatever. <laughs> Let's see how far I can make it, basically. Let's just see how far I can make it now, is the best way to describe it. All of you better stay away from that stupid cheese, because if you don't, you turn into that mutant rat, and I'm just going to let it kill me. I'll be honest with you. Never mind. That killed me. All right, that's game, ladies and gentlemen. That is it. Woohoo! The lock is over. I lost. I don't care. I'll be honest with you. I really don't care. Um, I don't understand why a game needs to be so needlessly difficult for literally no reason. Like, the, this game did not need to have an expert mode that's that expert. The fact that I probably would have to rip through all my Skyliners, for that, especially for locks, like, this is a way to make the game more challenging, yes, 100%. But to play it like that, 
I feel like I need to use every single one of those Skylanders over there to be able to beat this successfully. Especially Nightmare Mode. So yeah, let's open up the chest. We do this at the end of every Imaginator's run through. Let's see what we get. Let's see if I get some new stuff at least. New shoulder guards. Okay, I'm okay with that. Ladybug feelers. That's a new headgear. Only got four of those. So this is not very going to be very much, but that's fine. Robotic arm was an extra or duplicate. Sorry. Spider staff was a duplicate. All right. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you guys enjoyed this playthrough here. However, this is where I go and quickly look up what the next lock is going to be. Ooh! Speak of the devil. So remember I mentioned that probably Swap Force and Superchargers, I will not be going to a cheaper difficulty. I'll actually stay on, like, the hard difficulty. Well, we're going back to Swap Force, ladies and gentlemen. If you remember way back when I did a core lock, you remember the core lock? Well, eight of those cores didn't have their chance to shine. That's going to change in the next lock. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, the Swap Force, the other core lock, will be happening semi-soon on the channel. Probably within a month or two or something like that. But it'll be in the new year. Hope you guys enjoyed this playthrough no matter what, even if I did become very salty and upset. Enjoy that for your memes. That's all I know. But yes, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you guys enjoyed this playthrough. Thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you all next year for another awesome lock, because this is going to be the last lock for the year, of course. But as always, I bid you farewell.